Alright, so this is Kingsway. I am playing through it again. Uh, the last time I played it, it was a few years ago, so the VODs don't exist for this. It was during a time where I wasn't recording content yet. Uh, and enough time has passed. It's been like three, four years. There's new content for it, so... Let's, uh, let's play. This is a bit of fun. It might not be a full series, but we'll do a few runs of it. So... Um, cool. We can create a character. And we got different classes. Now, I think this is some of the new stuff. Which I'm not going to dig into. I'll leave it as is. Um, so let's just go with a typical adventurer. Alright. Balance stats. Um... Can edit the portrait. Give it a nice look if we want. But one of the great things about this, what you can do. I'll tell you what, I'll, I'll, let's just do a run with the default, and then we'll get into the custom stuff later. I'll keep generating one until... Yeah, you know what, that's good. Choose a starting gift. So, we can get more HP, we can get gold. Um, I think let's go with gold. Okay, so, double click the world to navigate through, so it does have a music player. Okay, so this represents my character's status, um, there's my inventory, let me get my windows arranged, and you'll see how interesting this concept is. Uh, we got an inventory back here. Let's put quests. Okay, I think we're good. The yellow circles on the map are map nodes. Click a node to travel to its location or inspect it for more information. There is a battle dummy. Some locations have events that trigger when you arrive. You must deal with the event before you can continue traveling. So yeah, then a pop-up window appears. <laughs> and then you click the buttons accordingly. Nothing found. Alright, leave and continue. And this is the premise of it. There is a supplies chest. There is a sign next to the chest that reads, One free potion per adventurer. Take the potion. So now we have the inventory, which I can just do here. So it's really weird. It's like managing files and stuff is a key game mechanic. Take a potion. Okay, this is the king's land. The king's castle is to the east. But be careful, traveling to the east too quickly. There are powerful monsters closer to the king's castle. So take your time to get some experience on the way. Okay, so now we have a quest. Welcome to King's Way. We here at the Adventure Corporation are here to guide you on your pilgrimage wait it's core not corporation core the first thing you want to do is get acquainted with the guild the guild is an organization that employs outsiders like yourself to do various tasks around the land their rewards will be essential to your journey bring them the letter 
that brought you here, and they'll take it from there. You can find guild outposts at any fort and in some small villages. Okay, King Summon. Um, so... That's a fort. So let's travel to this. Okay. Cool. Got there in no problem. Uh... The guild? Yep. Quests. King summons, rewards a supply bag. Done. Okay. So now I have a supply bag, which is another... Another piece of inventory management. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put it here. Um... What does this do? Suit to intellect 15% damage to demons. Okay. Gonna equip it. I can't use it. What's required? Oh, level two. Psh, okay, fine. I'm just gotta level up. Uh, I have 60 gold. What does this do? Two to travel distance. Magic power. Farm hat. We'll get. We'll buy ourselves a shield. I can't use the answer blocks. Oh, fuck, yes. <laughs> what is it? Level two. Of course. Ah, uh, weapon shop. Um. Crude dagger vitality. What is this? Plus three to vitality. Alright. I'm not gonna buy anything for now. Let's just... Oh, okay. Block. Okay. So you can see how... how the combat goes. I'm fighting pop-up windows and they're just annoying. Oh god. No, hold on! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> okay. Uh, loot. Living seed. Uh, loot. Another living seed. Okay, cool. So now I can get skills. Decrease damage taken by two for a short amount of time. Since I have a shield, I'm gonna learn it. Okay. Alright, that'll do. Um, we are level two now, so now I can take this. And now... We have stats here that I can allocate. I'll make myself vitality and, uh, strength. With a little intellect every now and then. Okay. You come across an enchanted healing fountain. Drop one gold. You make a wish. Drop one gold. Make a wish. I'm gonna keep doing it until down to 20 gold. We'll see. We'll see if karma helps me out here. Magic shield.
Okay, loot. You come across a wanderer crossing your path, they look scared. Approach. The wanderer appears to be injured and asks for your help. Give them a potion. Reputation increased slightly. The wanderer gains strength and thanks you. Ooh. Horned rap. Plus 12% damage to humans. Hurt them? No. I just- I just got horns for my character, like a viking. Uh, talk rumors. The wanderer says the shadow is coming. That doesn't sound great. Want the best deal on potions? Due to the recent influx of outsiders, out and dead, and demons in the area, health potions are in high demand. This trend is putting a lot of stress across on local apothecaries. I don't even know how to say that word. But with your help, we can both prosper. If you bring back as many beast eyes as you can to your nearest guild outpost, we'll make sure you get the best deal. Potion coupon. Well, I think they're referring to the ominous boss at the end. Okay, we got a dungeon. Enter. Treasure chest, nice. Approach. You approach the treasure chest. Open. Avoid. <laughs> Blue boots. They sound cool. An orb. Uh, move speed, yeah. Since I'm not a caster. Okay. Cancel. There's probably more to this. Ooh, shit. Right, it minimizes stuff. I forgot about that shit. Uh-oh. Where's my... Oh, damn it, I died. I forgot about the minimize thing. I... I fucking didn't survive much. <sighs> so yeah, that's the gist of it. It fucking... It minimized my window and I... It had my potions in there and I had to... I was trying to find it. I need to... I need to get used to that again. No, listen. Because we can do this. I've loaded some custom, uh... Some custom characters. Go Wario! Oh, yes! Uh, Wario. An odd character, strong and tough, but has a bad reputation. Perfect. Yes. Okay. Perfect. I don't think we need the log. I need to get used to this minimization thing. Okay, start the music. If I'm going to be worried, I better act like a greedy German. Alright, for those that don't know and are unaware, the context is Warrior was apparently designed to be German. 
gift potion. Mighty Skull Wand of Frost, alright. That seems uh, appropriate. Talk advice. Getting a good rest at the end will give you a bit of extra health, but don't waste time sleeping. Take one gold. Wow, your love's coins! Yes! It took 10 gold. You come across a deserted home. Do you enter? Um, you stand at the entrance of a deserted home. There are several rooms. Where do you want to go? Why do you go to the basement? Oh, yes. Should be okay with this. Okay, loot. Beast eye. That's what I needed in the previous thing. Okay. No level up. Okay. Uh, library. You enter the library. Unintelligible writing is carved on the wall. Uh, scroll of burn. Okay. Dining area. You enter the dining area. Did you hear a noise? There's a paper with strange symbols drawn on it. Take the paper. Monolith research paper. Okay. You enter the attic. It's messy. There's a locked chest. Unlock the chest. Orb. Invisibility potion. Alright, we're done here. travel. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> that goofy face popping up. Oh boy, this is not good. Why am I die? Oh my god! Why you die to mushroom? What the fuck? I'm gonna try that again. <laughs> yeah, this game's not easy. Oh, I missed. Okay. Uh. I'm going to give him more health, I think. Okay. Uh. Travel. You see a hooded figure, they approach it. The hooded figure appears to be injured and asks for your help. Eh. The hooded figure tells you about a great treasure. What is this treasure? What's up there? Cool. Okay, why do you go to the treasure? Hey, got the potion back. There's a group of thieves. They look aggressive. Approach. The thieves surround you. There are two of them. Ah, oh, what's this? Why are you trying to fight? I fight you off. Look at you, trying to steal from me. How dare you! Hey, 
Hey! Okay, uh, loot. Thief garb. Let me guess, level two? Level three. Hey, I took your tooth. What are you going to do now? Nothing. Okay. Frazier! Wario has an axe and a cleaver. Uh... Of course it's... Yeah, 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 I can't use it. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of shit that I can't use. You come across a locked treasure chest, approach it. Oh, shit. I'm pretty sure you can dual wield. It's just, uh, I would need to have the strength stats for it, which I do not. There we go. Um, leech. Iron stomach. Consume items instead of discarding them. <laughs> Critical focus. Vigilance. Um, ooh, that sounds okay. Evil eye. Permanently weaken the enemy. Grim aura. Yeah, this seems good. A temporary aura that poisons enemies when they attack you. It seems good. Okay. Wario is all about the strength. Not so very smart. Cost two mana, I only have six. Yeah, but. My spells are like that, anyway. Uh, oak staff. One, uh, way crystal. I guess that takes me to the next stronghold. I would do that selectively as well, not... Not really, uh... Constantly. Another hooded figure, what the fuck? Holding some treasure. We'll sell you the mysterious item. Alright. Oh no, I'm going to steal it. Wario pays for nothing. Okay, now this is where we use Grimora. I am Wario. I steal. But my reputation is bad, so... I mean, I'm already... Cruel Cleaver Vitality properties. Required level 5. Great. Can I use any of these? Required level 4. Required Strength 9. Uh, take gold. Wait, what's this? Oh, that's the aura thing. Yeah. I take the gold. Oh, yes. Okay, we've made it. No, we haven't. Did I pick the game so I could do the warrior voice? Mm, no. If I wanted to do the warrior voice, I'll just play warrior.
Besides, there are other characters there where I can't do their voices. Uh, guild. Do tired. Okay. <laughs> Happy. But I can't do that for very long because I feel like I I'll just yeah I won't be able to speak tomorrow. Um. I want Vigilance. Be able to attack quicker right away, that's great. Okay. Now, Strength, Vitality. And we'll do one more to Intellect, just to get a little more mana. Can I do Kermit? No, this is- I'm not gonna turn this into what voices can you- can I do. Hearty Ring of Judgment. Okay. This requirement is level 5. Why would I do... I'm probably just going to sell that. We can use the axe. There we go. Uh, thief Garb. There do we go. What does it give? Escape Chance. Check this out. This is my stage. And this should say Wario number one. Oh, I can't. Get the money. This will be... This will be... Uh... Stuff. <laughs> okay, uh... Back... Drag items that I want to sell. Yep. So... I mean... This doesn't seem great. I'm gonna sell it. Sell it. Uh, going to sell the dirty shirt. For zero, but who cares. Uh, Oak Cleaver. That's two to two. Two to four. Don't worry about the staff. What does Metal Hat give me? Just defense. It was the only enchanted thing I had, yeah, but it was, it was like negative stats to beasts. It was like minus 14% to gain a, a little bit of vitality, no thank you. should most definitely do this. So what I'm gonna do... There we go. Potions in one. Uh, in... I mean, eh, I think I'll, I'll be fine. Travel. I don't know if the skulls are going to do anything. You see a skeleton up ahead, but it does not notice you. What, did, what does Wario do? Does he approach it or does he attack? 
and Chorus Wario attacks. As you prepare to attack the skeleton, it notices you and tries to get away. Wario attacks again. Ah. Where do you think you're going? Where is my treasure? It's just a skull. Oh shit. Uh oh. Oh, that was cool. Uh, take. I mean, that's not gonna sell for anything, so leave it. Yes. Yeah, this extra attack being quicker, it's really, really helping a lot. Uh, I mean, I think I'm good. You arrive outside a campsite. There are a couple of large tents which are adorned with the guild's emblems. As soon as you enter the campsite, you're greeted by a guard of the guild. They offer you a place to rest and heal up. Yeah, rest. Cool. Talk to the drifter. The drifter looks like they've been down on his luck. Go back. Talk rumors. The guard tells you a, a rumor about a great treasure. And they mark its location on the map. Sweet. Where is the treasure? Oh, it's right there. You come across a locked treasure. It is being guarded by a creature. Approach it. Easy. That's just a dagger. So, can I dual wield? It might be a skill that I get later. Um, what was that? What? Have you seen my horsey? His name is Sponge and he was taken by some bandits. He must be so scared. Please bring him if you find them. A star has been added to your... Like, okay. I love the drawing. Another cleaver. Travel robe. What does it give me? Just travel distance. I pick it up. Uh, okay, it's to the right. Damn it. I'm not having good luck here. Level up, never mind. Burn club. Zero to two. Nah. Uh, leave and continue. Choose a new skill. I mean, I think gr upgrading Grimoire is probably a good idea. If I go pretty big on Vitality, I can make it so attacking Wario is just going to poison you. I could also do a build where I ate my inventory. <laughs> that seems on point with Wario, like he just takes a skull and just chews it down. Oh yes, it's the skull of a small child. Okay, cool, there's a beast die. Uh, that's a boss, right? Okay, I think I'm capable. Okay. Oh, shit. No. Ooh. Oh, God. Uh oh. Okay, uh, use potion right now. <laughs> Preempt it. Sweet. 
Stop summoning skeletons! Okay, uh, use potion. Oh, dude. Come on. Okay. No, stop! Use potion, use potion. <laughs> Fuck. Oh my god, I almost died. Okay. Uh, loot. Ugh, I might have to leave this dungeon already. Ooh, what do we got here? Book of Wand Mastery. Feather of Transform. What does this do? Feather of the Sky Eater. Way Crystal. Bell of the Dead. More battle experience, but attracts the undead. Okay. High Robe. Magic Power, we're not a caster. What is this? Do oh, come on. Okay. Uh I mean I'm gonna level up soon. Okay. Shit. I may have just paid the ultimate price here. Really? Huh? No. Use the potion just in case. Oh. Grimora. I needed to get poisoned. I'm gonna lose. Okay. Uh... Consume items instead of discarding them. Gain three health. So wait. Hang on. Is that healing or is that I gain? As in... Warrior gets stronger by consuming the skulls of small children. Alright, it's piqued my interest. Loot. Consume. I mean, I think it's a heal. Long sword. Three to four damage. Uh oh. Uh, I think I can fit a little more here. Well, it said gain three health. I, I guess it means heal. Okay. You come across a radiant treasure chest. Owl shield. 12% block. Okay. Pale circlet of intellect. Magic region. I mean, I could- I could- This wouldn't be too bad. Because... That would let me cast, um... My poison thing. Like, okay, strength is, is down, but... I can kind of do this to balance if it has region. How much does it weigh? Two. Okay, consume. Ah, it works.
back to the barracks. Are you heading off? All right, dude, no worries. Um, I mean, Wario may as well eat the cleaver. Wait, what? Oh, shit, strength. Hold on, that... That fucked up my strength alignment. Hold up. Consume. Eat the skull. How much does this weigh? Jeez, dude. I'll fix this. Okay. I think I'm okay now. <laughs> Silver Staff plus one. Yeah, it's a caster item, but I don't really... I don't really have room. Oh, just, okay. Damn it. Yes, yes, Wario's going to eat this guy. Delicious. There is a strange figure on your path. It is carrying a small bag overflowing with shiny objects. The figure is very focused, investigating every crevice of a nearby wall. With a closer look, you can see that the strange figure is some sort of demon-like creature. Talk. I'll let you look at my items if you promise not to hurt me. Continue. The demon th thanks you for sparing me. I'll let you look at the most wondrous objects I found, and maybe even sell you just one. Agility and attack speed. Okay. Increases all stats, but attracts demons. That sounds pretty good. Strange stone. Immune to curses. Vitality, attack speed, move speed. Ooh. It's between these two. Or what's the shield? Poison resist intellect. Shit, these are good items. Um. Yeah, I'm, I think the boots. Good find. Fifteen percent chance block. 12% chance block, okay. Wario, eat the owl shield, yes!
I'll cut it out. Oh. Jeez, that thing it got in it got in the way of my potion. I'll be okay. Okay, uh use item. Okay. Dude, give me skulls to eat. You come across a treasure chest. You open the treasure chest. Ah, no! Oh fuck, is this gonna- is this gonna hurt? Okay, it's dead. Present moon, lord's- lord tail. Grants one stat point, use. Okay. I think I can bring back my axe now. There we go. Enchant item. Less magic fine. Fuck that. How much does it weigh? It's probably worth a lot. Three. Okay, so I need to get rid of... Um, let's see what we can move over here. Skull for the skull throne, pretty much. I don't think I can. I mean, I tried to reduce the weight enough. Body must eat. Consume. Too full. Yeah, okay. Consume. Ruined armor. Defense three. Defense five. Okay. Consume! Damn it. Ooh, Fool's Nail Club of Judgment. Negative intellect, but 22% damage to demons. Um, but it's one to two, whereas in this is two to four. Twenty-two percent sounds like a lot, but it's not. Twenty-two percent of one to two, like, no. That's negligible. But if I can carry it, maybe? No. Um, does it have its value? I would imagine that this is worth more than the metal hat, so let's just consume. You come across a locked treasure chest. Okay. Haha. -ha. But there's nothing in the tre treasure? Oh no, there it is. 
Uh, Book of Burn. Permanently learn skill Burn. So I can just light people on fire. I don't think you can have two status afflictions at once, so I might just grab this, but not use it. Effigy. Damage reflection. I think I'm good. How much is that? Wait, two. Of course it is. Um, but I'm about to level up. Oh, wait, Crystal. There we go. Perfect. Why can warrior not eat the skulls? Fuck. do this. Yep, got it. Oh, lucky. Okay, uh... Slightly slower attack that deals 150% of the player's max damage. Briefly stuns the target, but see that first? Attack, it would work well. So, like... Strong attack, and then we make this attack, right? The first move is quicker, so this balances out. Okay, I think I should now focus on upgrading stuff. Priest Mask. 10% damage to bosses. Defense 4. How much does this weigh? 2. Um. Yeah, I kind of just left it like that. Now what your stuns? Travel. You see a sacrificial altar approach. The altar is decorated with a small skull and bloody candles. Sure signs of forbidden magics. Sacrifice 38 health. Yes. Your blood drips onto the altar and boils away into a dark smoke. The smoke twirls as it enters your body through your wound. You feel more powerful. Okay. Make sacrifice again. Plus one stat point. Um. I feel like I can do this again. I'm gonna start consuming items. Oh shit. I'm dead. <laughs> oh, 
Everybody or die to the blood skeleton. Okay. I'd survive to level six. Um. Oops, my bad. Majron? Alright, you got it. I know who to go for that. Morty! Morty! I mean, intelligence, we, it has to be Rick, right? And I had to rename that to the science bag. Morty, I did science to me bag. Now it's a bag that shoots shit. Okay, we got a dagger. Let's swap that out. Hardy Ring of Judgment. Two vitality damage to demons. Cool. Uh, let's go. We need to go to the magic shop. Limp Oak Staff of Agility. What does it do? Attack speed, but it learns burn. What about this? Agility, magic regen. That might be more useful. Or we can go here and buy potions to kind of, uh, but they're 18 each. I think... I'll do this. Wait, what level requirement? Intellect 7. Yep, when I level up, I'll get Intellect 7. Required level 4. Ooh, hold on. Maybe not. What about this? Required level 3. Or I could just double up on rings. I might just double up on rings. That seems like an earlier, more rewarding thing. There's a hooded figure in the distance. They look scared. Approach. Alright, we give him a potion. Rick has a good reputation. Talk rumors. I heard stories of strange altars in the dungeons below graveyards. Some say there's a sort of great power. Be careful of associating with forbidden magic. We'll see if Rick gets anywhere in this adventure. Okay, uh, intellect. We definitely need to go up. And vitality, because very weak. 
Okay, so what kind of magic are we gonna do? There's burn, poison, chill. I'm thinking chill. Slow them down. One sec. There. There. Cool. Approach. The hooded figure is holding some treasure and doesn't notice you talk. We'll sell you this mysterious item for nine gold. I'll take it. Mighty Cleaver. Two strength. Required level five. I mean, I'll sell it. Talk rumors. I've heard that people have cured themselves of curses by drinking water from the enchanted fountain deep in caves. Yeah, I mean, I think so. Slowing is probably a good thing. Chill out. Yeah, that works. Rats! <laughs> what do you mean, rats? Giant- Big rats! Giant disgusting vermin! Wait, disgusting. Disgusting. Get them out. I don't care how you do it, please. Guild special helm. Um. Okay, weapon shop. Let's just sell. Uh, magic shop. Wait, do they have potions? They don't have potions here. Wood wand, what does this give me? Magic regen. Uh, I think I'll hold off. It's probably better, right? <laughs> Just bought one of you. this one. I need to reserve my chill, so... Ooh. Okay. More ruined armor. That's defense three. I'm not having much luck here. <laughs> okay, cool. Uh... Yeah, I mean, just upgrade chill. Definitely want to keep pumping into intellect. I seem to be constantly getting, uh, that armor. You have arrived at the location for the quest, rats, continue. You stand at the entrance of the house, where there are several rooms. Where do you go? Bedroom. Uh, go back. Okay. That's a free rest. There are food scraps scattered all over the kitchen. A trail of crumbs leads to a hole in the wall big enough to peer into. Look in the hole. Oh my god. Buff rat man. Uh, 
I get the feeling there's gonna be more. So that's why I'm, I'm kind of reserving. Yep. Morty, there's a giant rat in here! <laughs> Book of Chill. Pump, but I have Chill. Would this level it up? Oh, wow. Alright, I just got Chill 3 for free. <laughs> That's awesome. What the fuck is that? Potion of Cure-All. Two strength plus four magic points. Morty, I got the mighty mystic hand! All fear, Rick! Check it out! Oh. <laughs> it's kind of appropriate. Like, a, I can see an episode of Rick and Morty where just grafts on this ancient power to his hand. Okay, you can hear skittering in the dark corners. Oh, there's more. I might preempt this. I don't like this. This, this is, uh... Fuck. Ooh. That was close. Reflect 14% of damage from physical attacks. Magical shield. Electric skin. That is... That is, uh... That is Rick right there. Oh, it's a passive. Cool. <laughs> That's perfect. He electrifies his body. Okay. Another base die. Well, this is going well. Being oh, that's not a great job. Fuck. Albert plus one. Ah, oh, I can't catch a break. Shit. Oh, I might not win this. Okay, Jesus Christ. Full potion of magic, perfect. Boots on. Uh, defense 2, travel distance plus 1. Probably use it. Oh, fuck me. I, I might be screwed here. Do I have personal invisibility? I don't. Heals all wounds. Okay, cool. No, I'm, I'm okay. I kind of had to. Okay, 
how to level up. Definitely electric skin. Okay. I hate how the stats kind of leave a bit of empty health. Open the treasure chest. Ugh. Ah. I'm just not really having much luck here. Okay. Book of Sword Mastery. Do more damage with swords. I'm good, I'm gonna sell that. Yeah. A lot of mimics. Motherfucker. Vitality, damage protection. What does this do? Strength, magic points. Plus one damage, more vitality. Maybe? Okay, I guess that's it. Oh, fuck off. Really? Three intellect, four move speed. No, yeah, we'll place it with this. One damage, they're not really great. Okay. I'm hoping that this is at the very least safe. It looks like any any nodes that I've traveled here are safe. Wait, how do we go back up? What? No! Oh, I'm basically fucked. Oh my god. How the fuck do I leave this basement? There's no upstairs part. Ah, it says I escaped! I escaped! Oh, come on! That's bullshit. 
<laughs> it was there, I had escaped! Alright. I believe. Metal starts with the gold coin. <laughs> Man, I'm not having any luck with this. Okay. Do I honestly need to grind or something? Okay, we've got a traveler's robe. Oh, apparently I can't use the item yet, so... Oh. The shadow is coming. I was gonna say, how have I not run into an enemy yet? Approach, hold into the treasure, sell you the mysterious item, buy it, spear plus one. Agility. Required level four. Okay. Well. Okay, there we go. We've got a treasure. And it's right next to me, conveniently. Cleaver. Uh, small shield, is that usable? Yep. Potion of attack, alright. What on earth is that thing? Either that's part of its body or that's something it's consumed. Oh shit. Why? I guess that's nice. Deserted home? Alright, enter. Let's go to the study. The floor is sticky with strange symbols on a piece of paper. Okay, I got that again. Dining area. Some bones are piled in the corner, there's a locked chest. Unlock the chest. Short sword plus one. Of course, can't use it. Just constantly finding stuff I can't use. Dodge. Chances that an enemy attack will miss. Toxic tip, adds three poison to the next attack. Lockpick, bandage, recover health after each battle. That seems very useful. Um, mm, yeah, I mean, let's just start with that. Okay. Travel. Uh, 
I love that, uh, the character I've made for this is just Mario with a shiv. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna move the icons that don't fucking matter out of the way. Magic sign, eh. What about... there's no weapon shop. Okay. Let's just invest in heals. You see a skeleton up ahead, but it doesn't notice you. Approach. The skeleton... As you get closer, the skeleton notices you and scurries away. Follow it. The skeleton escapes into a cave. Enter cave. Interesting. I mean... Hey, I got, I got Mario shoes. Defense three. Defense four, all right. Antidotes. I got the Bing Bing Wahoo shoes. Dude, nice. Just by following the skeleton instead of attacking it. I've earned my prize. Oh no. Holy shit. Oh how- Oh my god. That's a- that's a heck of a fight. Jeez. <laughs> Uh, tech dodge. It's a nice little passive. Okay, loot. I'll knock it off. I need a better weapon. ASAP. 8% block. 8% block is the same. Oh wait, I think I can use this now. Ah, uh, not yet. What am I missing? Oh, 
Required level four. All right, nearly there. Uh, negative one regeneration. Ooh, no, thank you. Uh, twelve percent block defense five. I got one more corner to check. <laughs> Zero to two. No, I'm good. Party Hand of Purity, 2 Vitality, Poison Resist, 9 Magic Points. It's a caster thing, though. Why couldn't I find this on the previous run when I was playing a caster? Like, I've gotten nothing but caster items. Typical, yep. It's okay. I should make it back to base before, uh... Before this ends up killing me. Okay, uh... Armor shop, let's sell some of this stuff. Got the money. Nice. I don't think I'm going to use the sword. Helm of Warding, plus one agility, plus ten percent magic power. Hmm. Nothing really there, that's interesting. Magic shop. Yeah, that's probably worth it. It's a minor hit to take to get more, uh, power. No quests, really? Put a map of the island in your storage box. Horsey. Okay. Storage, map of the island. Oh, there you go. I mean... Interesting. Okay. I'm still ages away from leveling up. So I should do that. Skeletons in your area. Requirement. I just sold all my skulls! I just sold them! <sighs> you dick. You couldn't- you couldn't have asked for this, like, 15 seconds sooner.
Okay, that's good loot. Hot skeletons in your area want to chat now. Oh boy. Okay. Strange symbols. Take the paper. Another monolith one. Okay. Nursery. Unlock the chest. Limp ring of purity. Uh, I'll just sell that. Two agility. Required strength seven level. Okay. Well. Attic. Kitchen. You'd click it, click what? Okay. That the skeletons in the area? I'll piss off. I just gotta find one more. I was kind of relying... It's okay, let's just do this. One agility, travel distance. There we go, that's what I wanted. Never mind, they didn't give me the skeleton skull. I just have to keep going back and forth. And eventually it'll give me the right one. There we go. Guild. Quests. Got it. Uh, sneak attack. Quickly. Inflict minimum damage to a target. Your first attack is a little faster. I reckon let's learn bandage. So we heal a little after each fight, that's not bad. Okay. Wait, did I up? Upgrade twice. Okay, agility, strength, vitality, agility, agility, vitality. Regeneration, move speed, travel distance, that is good. Okay, now we're using Spear. Okay. It's required Strength 7. Shit, I don't pay attention to that. Two Strength, 20% Poison Resist. Yeah, I think we're okay.
<laughs> get them skeletons, get them hot skeletons. Oh boy. But yes, as Nikto says, I think I prefer something with a little more meat on the bones. Hang on to this just in case that quest appears again. Okay. Now we're doing damage. Natural enhancements. What could this be? Ever heard of ghost caps? They are a type of mushroom which grows in caves. They get their name from the way they will make you dead if you eat them. However, if you know how to cut them and season them just right, they are a delicious snack. Also, their poison can be used against enemies if extracted properly. If you can bring me some of these tasty mushrooms, I'll extract the poison for you. Okay. And tough. Scroll of chill. Casts it. Alright, it's a single use. Cold. Yeah, I'm doing good damage now. Oh, that's by what they mean by the shadows coming, I see. There's a hooded figure in the distance. They look harmless. The hooded figure greets you. The hooded figure wonders what you'd like to discuss, rumors. The hooded figure tells you about a powerful monster and marks its location on your map. Okie dokie, um... It's kinda hard to tell. Alright, I'm going in here. Damn. This might actually go somewhere. There is a strange figure on your path. It is carrying a small bag overflowing with shiny objects. The figure is very focused, investigating every crevice of a nearby wall. Approach. With a closer look, it sees some demon-like interest. Alright, talk. I'll let you look at my items, you promise not to hurt me. I have money, so that's fine. For sparing me, I'll let you look at these wondrous objects I have found, and maybe even sell you one. Just one. Thirteen percent. Alright, three to six. How much is the spear? Three to four. It's an upgrade. It would need strength, though. What else have we got? Three intellects. Gold find. What about this? Two intellect, magic power. Poison resist block. Magic root. Immune to poison. Interesting. This <laughs> looks like garlic. Why wasn't this when I was playing Warrior? Um... Garlic? What do you mean, garlic? I'll purchase the root, I think. Immunity to poison is probably a big deal. Grunt armor. Another orb. Keep finding caster stuff. Ah, 
Ah, oh, yeah, I'm all cast and stuff. Oh. All right. Nice try, dickhead. The concept of fighting pop-ups is pretty unique. Another skull. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh shit, I'm blocking. Whoops. Another skull. Sacrificial altar. Um, I think I'm good. Last time I got completely fucked over by that. There's a boss. Ooh. I did not level up. Okay, I know what it's doing. Uh, going for toxic tip three. Okay. I mean, I, I guess that's good because it came out as a heal. Just manage time. I think with poison I should be okay. Got it. Yeah, use that right away. Ooh, Bright Spear of Leech. That's an upgrade. Shit. Skull mask, five percent lifesteal. Yes, please. Limp sword of strength. <laughs> Less attack speed with more strength, but I I'll take it to sell. Cruel ring of health. No, but I'll take it to sell. Hang on. 
just seeing what I can move. Okay. Um, let me use the white crystal. That'll take me back to town. Oh, there's a... Uh, I suppose I can go back. I think it's probably for the best that I do this. Use it as. <laughs> A traveling caravan crosses your path. They're riding to the fort. Yeah, hitch a ride. Oh, 10. Psh, fuck that, I'm just right there. Oh shit. Purchase. Got another small bag. Now we got more inventory space. Good find. He wanted me to pay 10. I'm gonna hang, hang on to these skulls just in case that stupid quest comes up again. Intellect, move speed, travel distance. What is this? Travel distance, all right. Um, assassin garb. Escape chance, 15%. It's probably not a bad idea. If I run into some shit. Which means I don't need this anymore. Okay. Urgent help! Requested. Um, what is the urgent help? Wait, special ring, Gelu's ring. Okay. Um, let me go fight. You come across a group of suspicious bandits. They look aggressive. There are three of them. We're going to fight. Because fuck you. I'm ready to level up. Am I? Am I healing more than the damage they're doing to me? <laughs> I just noticed. Okay. Ah, uh, cool. I would appear to be doing more damage. Mighty Bandit Blade. Put it. I guess I have a bunch of leech. Oh, Gelu's ring. I got the horse toy. What does a horse toy do? 
Sponge is ri Oh, and that as well. I found sponge. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Damn. That's two quests done at once. I'll piss off. Uh, yeah, it's minimizing. Submit. Wait, but I don't have that quest. Huh? I don't have that quest. But I found the horse. Gelu's shield. Whoa, that's a yellow. Immune to stun. Magical shield 4. Intellect required level 8. That seems like a big deal. What's the strength requirement? No requirement. Okay, cool. Uh, vitality, agility, agility. I guess I just gotta wait to get that quest, eh? I think I got my footing a bit more now. <laughs> I think I got my footing a bit more now. Yeah, okay. So these things are not are not threatening in, in the slightest. Trying my hardest to get to the next area, but it's not allowing me to do it. Another wanderer. Upgrade your gear. Okay, hold up. I'm an enchanter looking to help where I can. If you can meet me at the mark location on your map. I'll enchant a weapon or armor of your choice. Help him. Okay. You help the Wanderer. The Wanderer tells you about a treasure. Fucking hell. <laughs> There's so much going on. But at least uh, I'm in a position now where I'm not really taking damage, so that's nice. Also, the shadow's catching up, which is not great. Okay. Ooh, this one's strong. Level three. Garlic again. What is this? Another garlic. King's icon. Cleaver. All right. I gotta hurry.
Ugh. Getting ominously close. Stop it! Okay, we've got to be quick. Unlock chest. Red boots. Travel distance plus four. What's the other one? Okay, sure. Travel. We gotta get to their stars. You won't believe this potion. What is it? <laughs> Gather three living seeds. Foted potion. Okay. Oh. Cool. I think this is the thing I need to defeat. feel powerful. Put it bigger. Seize your leather shoes and offer to buy it. Leather shoes? Oh, that. Yeah. Talk rumors. The shadow is coming. I can, I can see that. Thank you. Rotten Ruin Armor of Intellect. Okay. You are oppressed by an old scraggly witch-like figure, hunched over wearing a hood and walking with a large staff. The witch comes up to talk to you. Avoid. Good. There's a blacksmith that reads, upgrade your items here, approach. The blacksmith greets you with a warm welcome. Provide me the materials and- oh, speaking of. Okay. Upgrade item. Oh, but I don't have any of that. Assassin garb, two skulls. Upgrade. Defense plus three, level of client plus one. Didn't I upgrade it? I did. What's the level requirement on this currently? Defense 12, level requirement 8. Yeah, we can do it again. Upgrade. Right, so that... Okay. I guess that's as much as we can do. You have arrived at the location for the quest, no subject. There is a small house on a tree standing nearby looking for a missing horse named Sponge. 
Give horse toy. Thank you, thank you, the child screams in excitement. Wait here, they run inside. Wait. Small pack. More inventory space. <laughs> okay, cool. Thanks, kid. This is actually going well. Damn it, I was kind of hoping for a skull. There's a dark monolith. The ground is raised as if the monolith was pushed below the surface. The monolith towers above you, absorbing all the sound. Make an offering. I'm pretty sure this is how this works. Make offering. The monolith takes your offering and nothing happens. Make offering. The monolith takes your offering and glows warmly. You feel more skill. Plus one skill point. Alright, it does work. Uh, I guess let's just... Hang on, what else have we got? Keen. Gain an extra stat point every time you level. Fuck yeah. Okay. There's another one there. I think I can use the blue item. The caravan, talk to the merchant. Okay. Something really interesting. is that thing. Okay, I'm gonna magic shield because I get the feeling this thing is gonna be bad. <laughs> Wait, where'd it go? Oh, it minimized the battle, you dick. Stop it! <laughs> Ooh, that's sneaky. Okay. Uh, make offering. Pretty sure this will work. Give offering. Skill point. Alright, leave. Skills. I can't upgrade it. Um... When you successfully block an attack, you reflect. Okay, final blow. Hasten. Hasten. Your attack speed increases by 8% every time you attack. That seems good. Okay. You have arrived at the location for upgrade your gear. You enter the enchanters. They begin examining your items. Yes, yes, you have some items here I can enchant. Please choose one, only one. I mean, I put a lot of points into this, so let's just go enchant. Shit, it requires level 9 now, though. Um, leave. Okay, but it's... Is it active? I can't even tell. Alright, screw it. Just assume it is. Okay. 
Hey, Sandy. You arrive outside a campsite. There are a couple large tents which are adorned with the guild's emblem. And talk to merchant. What have we got? Another bag. I mean, I feel like I'm good on bags. I'll talk rumors. Tells you about a powerful monster. Alright, leave. Just nearby. Damn it. Ooh, this one's actually strong. Hold on. Use. I didn't even pay attention to that. Magic shield. Buckler. Top percent block. Spirit mask. Okay, so no. See, it's not applying. So I need to temporarily get out and out. You stand before one of the three beacons. The ground is littered with corpses and outside. Ooh, no, 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 no. But this is... I'm pretty sure that's big boss. Um, uh, maybe I can do it. I'll go fight this thing first. Cloaked figure, they're looting corpses from a recent battle. As you get closer, you can sense a dark aura. Uh, attack. Cloaked figure banishes. Oh, fuck. Hit use. Bloom? Oh shit, what the fuck? Ah! Oh god. The other one went behind the window, I couldn't see where it went. Oh, this is annoying. I don't like this fight. Shit. Shit, I'm running out of time. You arrive at the town, but something isn't right. You can hear nearby yelling, and there is smoke coming from one of the buildings. The town is being attacked by beasts. The townspeople need help fending off, or the town will be lost. Okay. Guess we're doing this. <laughs> Wish I could upgrade, but I can't right now. I'll stop it. 
Magic shield. Are we done? Loot. Beast eye. Um, fuck. Okay, skills. If the enemy has less than 16 health, kill them. Uh, bandage. Hasten. Let's go hasten. Okay, uh, agility, agility, vitality. Oh, there's more. Vitality. back on. These are too expensive, otherwise I would go them. Um, uh, the monolith, alright. I need to get to it quickly. Approach, give potion, talk, treasure, okay. I don't know where the treasure is, but let's just... Okay, sweet. Good timing. I don't know how many I need. I think I need four overall. Uh, make the offering. Nail. Give the offering. There we go. Oh, there's, there's a treasure there. <laughs> Shit. Approach. Open. Avoid. Alright. Just junk. It's okay. I'm out of the shadows. Ah! No, I'm not. Leave. Leave. Ooh. Yeah, this is not good. Game wants me dead.
Long cleaver. No. Nah. Good. Stop it! I need to get to this thing. Okay. Approach. Light the beacon. Here we go. I'm hoping that my attack speed will be quick enough to get this done. Oh, is this thing tanky? Oh shit. Ah, oh, I went behind. Oh. <laughs> Cut it. I think I got this. Got him. Brog's Helm. Skill bandage 2. Less vitality, attack speed 5%. What does this give me? 5% lifesteal. I think the 20% to bosses is huge. Uh, Charm of Fortitude. Health drains slower when damage is taken. Maybe. Okay. Alright, did it. There's another beacon over there. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I had to use it. I need to go buy more potions. Wait, what was the quest? You have been selected. We have noticed your interest in the two power true power of the monolith. The password is no sky world. I don't think I can really use any of this. Strength and agility 15. It's a good upgrade. Hmm, okay. That's what I was trying to do anyway, so... Okay, go back. I forgot I had a skill up. Hasten again. Okay. There's a hooded figure in the distance. They look curious. The hooded figure is holding some treasure and doesn't notice you. Alright, sure. What is it? Hardy Wizard Shirt of Warding. It's okay. Gee, it's a shame I'm not a caster. Have you heard of the Foundation? They stay in the mountains summoning demons, but why? Demons are so dangerous, they must be planning something. I 
I mean, at least I've survived longer than the other characters. Okay, uh... What else have we got? Next time you would die, you don't, but you lose the skill. Reset the enemy attack bar. Parry. Sneak attack. Escape attack. Vigilance. Mm, let's go toxic tip. Um, well, apparently I can use this now. You have arrived at the location for you have been selected. There is a crave, but the entrance looks too small to fit through. Leave. There's a dark monolith. The ground is raised. Okay, approach. Make an offering. Um, don't need this anymore. DPS. Alright, level 5 skill. Wheel shield. <laughs> 15% chance block. I think I'm good. I'm sticking with my yellows. Um, ugh. I mean, let's sell, but I would have loved to have gotten some health. Health would have been nice. May as well add that to cart. I don't don't have enough. Don't have enough. I need one more living seed. I'm not really sure I'm ready for this. Avoid. I think the shop's reset as long as I walk back and forth. Oh boy. That's not good. Okay, there is, but... Teleport to the nearest fort, please. Can't use that right now. Okay.
That's a bit better. I mean, good enough. Uh, weapon shop. A lance for 74 gold. Agility 38, but it does 12 to 17. Mm, not yet. Where the fuck is- where is- where is this? There's another monolith. Okay, you want something? They won't sell things like this. Look in the town. Dark armor. Corrupts a great scythe of intellect. Ancient hand. Sky effigy. Cult mask. Dark armor. Book of Apocalypse. Learns Apocalypse, but probably... <sighs> Damn it. off. Okay, approach, make offering. This isn't really gonna. The ground rumbles, a red light can be seen towards the center of the island. Um... Yeah, I mean, I think Vigilance is probably a good idea. Enemies seem to be getting scary. I don't know. <laughs> oh, fuck off. It's like right there. Okay, my attack speed's starting to really do well. Um, potion shop again. I mean, I think this is definitely what I should be doing. Okay, uh, weapon shop. That is expensive. Required strength 21, required agility 23. Good weapons, though. Uh, I didn't get the living seeds. Oh, I don't like this. This is passing too much time. Okay, let's go. Jeez, dude. The things are kind of eating my health. Another wanderer. The wanderer greets you. Talk, rumors, the foundation, yeah.
Okay, good. Um... Yeah, I mean, hasten again. Fall into agility. I keep approaching stuff, it's not fair. Two of them fight them, fuck's sake. Party Ring of Health, Vitality, Regeneration, what have I got? Regeneration, move speed. One intellect, but increases attack speed. It's still good, I think. Search the treasure, Hardy Cart Shield, Gold Nugget, which I imagine I just sell for gold. Um, I know I just came from here, but if I can buy a weapon, it'll make it worth getting unlucky with these. I think on the way out I will definitely chug an invisibility potion. Dude. close. Um. Kind of got unlucky. Okay, how much does a gold nugget sell for? It says someone may want this. Hmm. Want to extend your life? Requirements. Two living seeds, skull, base star. Okay. I think I have that. I do. Okay, uh, use... Invisibility potion use. I need to get across here without triggering fights. Okay, enter, uh, talk to Drifter. No, thank you. Oh fuck, that was stupid. Exorcist wanted. Oh no. The shadows are getting closer.
Okay. I'm gonna use this again. Just so I can get there. Okay, approach. Light the beacon. Here we go. mental on the attacks. I'll be okay. The helm. Uh, 60% damage to humans. Charm of Ascension. Increased damage every blue growing monolith. Yep, there we go. Badish. Required strength 20. Haste and five. Um, I guess go to the next one. Table, there's a note on the table. Beware the basement. Check portraits. Okay. Check table, check pantry. Silver key. I grabbed the silver key. The basement is locked. Go upstairs, small bedroom. Nothing but a bed. Master bedroom. Check wardrobe. Use the silver key. And some lantern. This may be useful. Go downstairs. Basement. Use silver key. The key does not fit. Lounge. The fuck? Guess there's nothing. Uh, let's go to the next boss. I'm feeling confident. Shit. Hang on. Upgrade your items here. Talk. Upgrade the flail. Okay. I can upgrade the helm. I'll do that. Okay. 
number three. That I'm good. Morv's Helm. Attack speed, gold fine, intellect. Eh. Charm of hate. Enemies fight you more often, no thank you. Okay, uh. Five is the highest it can go. What else have we got? Resurrect, critical stun. Alright, sounds good. Required Agility 38, still not enough. Required Agility 24, 9 to 12. It's better. Okay. Taking it. I mean, I just spent to upgrade this one. Hang on. Fuck. Talk. Look into the bag. Rev of health, what is it? Regeneration, damage to demons, intellect. Hmm, I don't know. Shit, the shadows are getting closer and closer. I'll sell it.
the fuck? Something deep? What's that mean? <laughs> Ancient hand, uh, mighty ring of stamina, strength and travel distance. Eh. A horn. Okay, uh, talk to merchant. Good. Purchase. Purchase. Okay. I'm just seeing if there's anything else I can do here. I can upgrade that again. Hang on, let me just be careful here. Required level 10, yep, we're good. Upgrade. Okay. Oh, that's already done. Uh, world map. To the king's castle. You see, the king's castle, it's oddly quiet. Nothing grows on the ground. With the three guardian beacons lit, the gate opens before you. Why does it have question marks? Okay, we're good. Rune dagger. Nine to ten. This does ten to fourteen, but... Hmm... I don't know if it would attack quicker. It's kind of hard to say. Okay, that was a waste. It's okay. I'm on it. Keep clicking attack. Good. Mighty ring. Six strength. I think I'll level up at the end of this fight. Um, critical stun. Can I upgrade? No. Okay, what else have we got? Flee. Final blow. Parry. Sync attack. Critical focus. Chance to crit. Yeah. Because that'll stack with the stun thing. Okay, agility up, vitality up. Nice. 
Oh. Okay, bye. Orb. Strange bone. Well, it says tw five to fourteen. I guess it's the same. This is better. Okay. Another hardy ring. Uh, vitality and crit damage. Okay, I'm gonna swap. Can't use this item yet, why not? Required level 17, okay. Am I under leveled? Shit, I hope not. years since you've seen this. Yeah, I heard this got an update at some point, so I wanted to check it out again. Hardy Rune of Flight. 23 defense, 14% escape chance. I think I just got my... I can't use it. Why not? Required level 26. Fucking hell. Um. Gotta make room for it. Okay, and what about this? 10 agility, 11 to 14. This is probably better. much weight is a six. It's not going to be enough. I'll just take a chance, leave. Mm. 
I mean, I think I got the power to do this. I'm not exactly struggling. The fuck, where am I going? Jeez, dude. Okay, well, at least that's... that's kind. Hardy Ring of Fury. Fury. Not usable yet. I'm getting good loot, but I just don't know what to do with it. Another rune dagger. I just leave it. focus because the more I crit the more I stun yeah I mean that's what am I losing my mind where the fuck am I supposed to go here Say, do I have an invisibility potion just to kind of make this easier? Yeah, use it. Can't pick it up anyway. Helmet of strength, I'm good. No. Is this really all where I needed to go? Ah, oh, damn it. Okay. I mean, I guess I, I did level up and gain some stuff. Dark Mace. Required strength 38. Required strength 38. I'll take the antidote. Gold staff. Nope. Required strength 24. Can't use it. I'll take the potion though. Mighty Ring of Warding, Strength and Magic Power. I mean, pick it up. Come on, something agility based, please. Limp, attack speed, no. Nope. And it's an orb, great, okay. So 
superb. I got nothing for my character. Okay. You approach the king's throne. The king sits stiff and frail. He looks at you and lets out a short sigh. A knight next to him in full armor speaks to him. You have proven yourself to be the strongest outsider. If you believe you are stalwart enough to fulfill the prophecy, then show me your power. Okay. Go stuns, go. Just picture Mario shiving a guard. Use. The royal disc. Um, 13 to 14. 11 to 14, 10 agility. Nah, I'll stay with what I have. I will take this, however. Um, just use this. Really? I bet you it weighs two. There we go. The guard collapses. There might be hope after all. A layer of dust falls from the king as he lifts himself from the throne. Using a large staff to hold himself up, the king mutters an incantation and looks to his side. A portal opens behind him with a flash of light and a dark aura. The king sits back down in his throne and points towards the portal. He says nothing. In front of you is a blue portal. As you approach, the king speaks. The portal will take you to the body of the Sky Eater. I only have the power to send one person through, so it's up to you to find a way and destroy, destroy the Sky Eater from the inside. Okay. What the fuck is that? That looks like a dog. Ow. Okay. Yeah, let me just preempt a little here. <laughs> Is that Master Chief? Go, metal, go. The Book of Greater Heal. Required intellect 14. Yeah, we don't. I mean... Wow, oh, didn't have the stats. I just haven't had any luck with the fines. <sighs> ah, of course. Why would it be treasure? It's okay, I'll level up from this. Critical focus. Agility is at 50. There you go, some nice numbers there.
There is an enormous heart-like organ. It beats heavily. You can feel it. Destroying this will surely destroy the Sky Eater. With great force, you manage to pierce the flesh of the heart. There is no blood. Instead, a rush of air. It's beating, and a lump opens to reveal an eye twice the size of your head. Talk to it. Try to commute with the AOK for this. Okay, well. I'm getting rid of this one first so I can... Quickly... Resurrect. Next time you die, you won't die. Learn the skill. Done. I'm putting all into agility. The fuck? The heart stops completely. There is a perfect stillness for a moment before the room around you begins to shrink and, ev and the air is sucked out from every direction. You try to escape, but the passage quickly becomes too small. The air is gone. You lose consciousness. Huh? Okay, that's an ending, apparently. But... What happened to the... Me getting a second life, huh? I was supposed to resurrect. I got a class called the Worthless. Um... But I can unlock some stuff. <laughs> Wait, there's convenience stuff? Open the character screen. Open the main bag. Open... Dude. Um... I feel like open the main bag is probably very useful. For that thing that minimizes stuff. Um... Okay, I mean, that's interesting. Everything that opens key, book a skill. What does book a skill do? Doesn't say. I reckon a backpack. Alright. Cool, well, uh, that was a successful run, I guess. I just got the ending where I sacrificed myself. Despite getting the passive that lets me resurrect, but sure, I guess... I guess I can't resurrect into nothing. All right. <laughs> well, that was uh, a little bit of King's Way for a while. I might do another session of it and check out some of the other characters, but it's a fun game. I might look up the new content and how to access it. Um, it's a bit of a weird one, but there you go. Okay, I'm taking a small break and then I'm going to do some attempts at Risk of Rain. So if you're down for that, stick around. I'll be back in like five minutes or so. But if you're here just to check out King's Way, thanks for watching.